Welcome back to Unprovoked, the podcast where we talk about all things and to provoke you and how to navigate through those things. I am your host. And I don't want to navigate no more. <laughs> you know I what? Will, <laughs> I'll give it. I right. would like we get a pass. <laughs> to start this episode by saying congratulations to Brit for going viral on TikTok. Woo! Period. Oh my God. Tell us about your viral oh moment. My God. Yo, we on, we on group FaceTime. She was like, yo, I think I just went viral. I'm like, what you mean you think? She said, it's just not stop. I went on her page. It was at like 300. I was like, Whoa. it's still going. It's Whoa. still going. Period. Um, I was just chattering. <laughs> Seven o'clock in the morning waiting for my client. And I just responded to this girl that was saying basically like she does not want, like her desired clientele is not the nine to five clientele. Uh-huh. And I'm like, you're stupid for segmenting those people out. And I guess all the nine to five girlies was like, Found me, and it was like, right, I've been with my stylist this long, and blah, 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 and it just went crazy from there. And, you know, I'm a chatty patty, so I'm in. You send them comments. Client process, I'm like, because. First off, I'll go on the video after she said it went viral, and, like, there's, like, a hundred and something comments, so I'm, like, scrolling. Long behold, Brittany has commented back to every single one of them. I'm like. (laughs) Yes. Meanwhile, I'm we over here to. trying to fight back for my little bit of comments that I be having. Yeah. I yeah. can't. I don't have it in. I was in the. I was in the comments. I said, "Ooh, I, I felt that." Hello. <laughs> like, Hello. Yeah. But it's a It's a hot topic. It is a hot topic right now. I so. feel like the girls are really starting to understand. Like y'all trying to get over on us in the beauty industry for the girls that's making this just a hobby mm-hmm. and trying to make some coins off of it. Mm-hmm. The girls are not having it, which is making my job a lot easier because when they come and experience. Good quality. I dream of Britney hair. <laughs> yes, okay. Yeah. Be- because the, the girls, girls we lazy. want quality service. Right. Mm-hmm. Right. So it's just like they're not getting it at the the one, two, three shops where or the the um I'm coming to your house or I you in the back room. Like, like this is a luxury service, right? Because we don't gotta get our hair done. We don't right. have to get our lashes done. We don't have to get our nails done. We don't have to get a pe- we don't have to do any of these things. We're doing it as extra to make ourselves feel good. So it's luxury. The worst is when, like, you go and get your lashes done, your eyes are taped, and your lash check got a whole bunch of ruckus in the back, getting up, picking up the phone, talking to her man, arguing on the phone. Right. Her baby needs something to eat. Like, right. Girl, now my eyes are taped, so my anxiety is at an all time high. And. Even like the way y'all treat like clients. That part. We are, this is a luxury service. If we decide we don't want to do this, you don't make money. And I think that's where a lot of girls like forget. It's like people know, like clients know that they have options. So just because they may try, like take one thing, two things, whatever from mm-hmm. you, they know they can go somewhere else. That's and I think I'm that's big where. On big on yes. it. And um, don't cancel my appointment last minute and think I'm going to stay with you. That happened to me. And. I left my girl, like, done forever. Like, I was, I'm was, i a good client. I come every two weeks religiously, blah, blah, blah. I tip well. So when you start getting too familiar, and it's like, oh, I, I can move her. I can do this. Mm-mm, I'm out. Mm-hmm. Because I, I treat you too well. I pay too much to be, I'm the one that you don't. Yeah. Like, no, this one right here, she's 30. Mm-hmm. You so, move shit around me. Yeah. Right. Right. And a lot of service providers now are acting like they're the prize, where it's just like, Mm-mm, you need to figure out your life around me. Mm-hmm. Baby, you provide a service. Mm-hmm. That's your job. Like, I think they forget that. This, this is your job. They think You that, have to show up. Yeah, they want to. They want you to come, and you got to be quiet. You got to pay a few 10 minutes early to pay a few 10 minutes late. Yep. <laughs> come, pay, washed. come washed. Come <laughs> wash. Make Blow sure it's braided. You must have braided. You must be have braided cat. for the braids. Yeah, be braided for the braids. <laughs> Help her take out the um, the previous install. Wash the girl that's sitting next to you for yeah. me. And if girl. you don't do that, I'm charging you extra 15 hours. It's just like, it's just it's too much. It's it too is too a lot. There's a bunch of, like, rules, stipulations. You yelling at me online. Yeah, yeah. like... How about I the must girl? have cash. Why? How about, How about the girl? Who, Why do I have to stop at the ATM to get cash? It is not my job to help you hide your money. Like, <laughs> what about the girl who um the lash tech who who ch- charges if you don't take pictures? Did y'all see that? No. The la- so the lash tech and the client. <laughs> the lash tech and the client. Y'all didn't see that. It was viral. <laughs> 
The last second the clan got into it because the girl refused to take pictures after the service. So the last tech was like, you're going to take the pictures and you should have read the, the print on the website. It's an extra $15 if you don't take the picture. See, the see. girl called the cops. Like, I'm out of here. I'm going. There was this. I saw something today. Extra $15 if you don't want to take pictures. What are we doing? That's Bitch, crazy. you should pay me to take pictures. How my do we picture. get here? Like, how are we... you like, supposed this to take is, something off the this service. This is scamming. Like, <laughs> hey, can I take a picture of you? I'll just take an extra $10 off. Yo, when you go get fillers, fillers in your face, they say if we're able to record you and post pictures of you, you will get a discount on your service. Right. I saw this girl yeah. was like... Lashes? Bitch, you need me. <laughs> right. <laughs> you need these eyes. <laughs> that part. This girl was like, I'm looking for models. Okay? Models. A hundred and fifty dollar fee, and you got to be okay with taking a lot of pictures. And it said literally lots of pictures. And I'm like, you need models, and you're charging them to model for you. It doesn't work like that. The girls are confused. We may have to do a little class, you know. And that might send me. That might take me to infinity and beyond. Come on, that thing I'm missing my call. Wait, okay. The girls might need a class. But yeah, so yeah, that happened, and yeah, it's just I think just it's just people in general. With like, I was just having this conversation with my girl while I was on my way here, and she was talking about um the way some people act on social media, especially women. Yeah. So she was like, you know, this girl, she has a daughter. She's on like a table in a restaurant, like twerking on the table. But, like, she does music or, I, I don't know, something. And, like, that was, like, her way of, like, whatever. And there was a guy eating, it, like, next to her. And she was like, oh, this tastes better than whatever, blah, blah, blah. On the video on Instagram. So we were just saying, she was like, you know, people be like, this is the sexy red era. No. And I'm like, it does. But I said, but the thing is, if, it, if we're in our, like, if you're a teenager, then it's like... She's a teenager. She don't know no better. If you're in your 20s, it's kind of like... You get a pass because you're You're kind of lost. Y'all is old with kids <laughs> <laughs> at this big age. You think you're going to do that? But it's like, where is the common sense? Like, where did we lose? Like, this is not how you're supposed to act as a person. See, that's the thing. It's not common sense. It's one of those things where it's just like... It's a thing of value. I don't know where in today's society is like our brains no longer have the, I shouldn't do this, or I shouldn't say this, <laughs> or I shouldn't operate like this, or, you know, acting like this probably isn't appropriate, especially online. And then the worst part is, is that, like I said, a lot of these people do have children. Those children are going to grow up. There's a lot of things that will never leave the internet. Like, But you got to think a lot of women, a lot of people, people in general, don't think like that. This is their regular life. This is how they operate. This is what they find okay. And they don't see an issue. It's crazy. I seen this guy on Instagram yesterday. <laughs> I seen this guy on Instagram yesterday and he had like a very is it provocative page where he's like cleaning his refrigerator and his thing thing is just like he's like he's purposely going like this because it was it was it was it was a decent what's side. The, what's, what's the page? <laughs> I totally forgot who posted it. And he's For like, research. he's like, and I'm like, first of all, of course I'm going in a circle. Windmilling. What? But it was just like, okay, we see what you're working with, but right. It was just so But why are you doing that? It was, it, was, it was so crazy. But that's the thing. So I went to the comments. Every girl was like, corny, disgusted, why, ill. Because it's like, even if your shit why is in? big, right? right? Now, why would we want <laughs> I went too. Why, why y'all didn't? I went too because I wanted to see the content that he mm -hmm. posts. Like, if this is like a normal thing that he does, and I'm like, oh, yeah, this is some normal corny shit that you do. Yeah. But why, as a man, do you think that that's okay? Like, yeah, girls do it all the time. <laughs> That shit is weird. Like, it's just how you stuff in balls. Windmilling. Like, cleaning the fish right now. Like, uh, yo, uh, if you want to go viral, you <laughs> But that's what I'm saying. Like, there's no more, like, social media has made people's, like, sense to, like, what you should do. 
like they're just looking for the a viral moment so it's like people just you know go to whatever the trend is like even when is the trend throwing your dick in the circle to go viral i gotta find that page i forgot who goes to that i think people see what viral can bring you yeah so they do anything to go viral like that's what i was saying like even like yesterday i was on live if you guys don't know i do trucking so with trucking it's another industry that people just get online like you can make five thousand dollars in one day like just let me see let me show you how and then everybody's like oh my god let me get into it like no, this is a business. You still need a business plan. Like, you're going on Instagram listening to these people that are just saying whatever to go viral. And everybody is following. But, yeah. And it's it's scary. Because I was actually talking to, in the salon today. And we were like, when did things go so bad? And I was like, I think it was 2015. <laughs> where it was just back? like, Vine became a thing. Vine came up in like 2015. Uh, I think it was uh, after. Do it for the Vine. No, I feel like when Vine came up, people saw how fast you can become famous. No, but I think Vine was more like, I think it was more already people who was into content. Vine was so short lived. I think, you know, it changed to something else. I think Instagram just stayed afloat. You know what changed it? Um, COVID, when TikTok was lit. Well, it changed what? Like that's when most regular people start getting to thirsty. Try to start making content. Cause if yeah, because Tory Lanez was like, "I'm gonna make me some money, some somehow, some way." Y'all try to go free the boy, right? Free the boy. Because if you look at most like, people who is big on Vine, they've always been into like content. You get me? Like, oh, I get what you're saying. Or like they've always been some type of YouTube, or they kept it going after. I think TikTok took like the average person. Yeah, because I feel like Made I could. Um, to like, I feel like I could make one little video cleaning my house and go up on TikTok. Okay, you could. so you are. 100% you get the right, right. hashtag. Clean you are hundred percent right. Like you look at most regular, they just post TikToks. Like, yeah, cause yeah, like <laughs> the girls, like the girlies I used to follow on YouTube. Um, I looked at the like I not aspired to be like them, but they were like my role yeah, model. Remember, like M. Reezy. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Now everybody think they am. <laughs> Everybody think they Shayla. Yo, like Reezy was literally like the celebrity. Yes. And she didn't that's even have a YouTube. That's what I'm saying. At some yo, point. Yo, people used to. Yo, Anne Reezy was such a big like icon. First of all, who, we don't even know what she's ever done. No. Other than be like. I thought she did makeup. And never did makeup on a soul. Oh. Ever. Well, she used to work at a makeup store. She never did makeup on anybody. She was just like but she used to a, the always girl. Do her makeup so well, and then that was an an era that we didn't. Now it's like thirteen year olds do their makeup better than me. Mm-hmm. Child, <laughs> see these proms? <laughs> do you see the prom? Okay, let's get into prom twenty twenty four. Girl. It's going, it's going so. I thought twenty twenty three was bad. They having galas before the prom. Bro. It's insane. The horses, okay. You the, seen the girl with backup dancers. Uh, wait, were they you in seen, black? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, she was walking out her crib. She had three people come out before her. And the dance. routine was terrible. The girls was terrible. yeah. They had a whole routine it to was, dance. It, then she came behind them. Yeah. Like, man, I've seen, I think I the, did see this whole gala before the prom. Thing. Yo, like, like, the, the like it looks like a baby shower, like a wedding, 50th That's birthday a, party. Where are these parents at? Because if I ask my There, <laughs> there, okay, on the camera, blowing, blowing money like, yes, Yo, Devon I, I also think, though, that when we say about going viral, I also feel like these parents want to go viral so bad it's that they're doing season. it. That's right. It's like they're season. doing. It if I told my mom, I want a uh, send it off. Right. Yeah. I think that's what she it's called. She would be like, bitch, what the fuck are you talking Prom about? Prom send off girl. or something, something. That's the name of it. Girl. Like I saw this one girl like have like a breakdown, like dress a thousand dollars. Yes. Shoes, 500. Um, Car. It was like another whatever. Send off party. 10,000. Girl. <laughs> Catch it. Catch it. Them 10 bands got you. I know you're fucking lying. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. 10,000. And it's just But you like, know what it is? That's the college fund now because these kids ain't going to college now. So, hey. That part. Fuck it. We gonna put it somewhere. 
That's that where part. you go. They, I'm gonna give you the content. Get them a camera, a car, ride around to your content. Hope you blow like that. Cause and kids like, ain't going to college. They be dripped. Okay, it was dripped. one boy. They had he had one of them like things you stand on, and it just it spins in the circle. It was like his face. It was a custom spinning <laughs> stage. And I was watching it because it was spinning so fucking slow, and I'm like, I'm like, when doing the most goes wrong. So he did with the. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> and just spinning slow And I'm like why Why And then Yo, they got the crazy. money The money to the end it, Yo it is crazy But I will Prom say for me was it this One no. thing I do I wish that um, When I was in high I school I thought I was doing something When I got a custom made dress Yeah my dress was custom made too Mine too both of mine Yeah mine was custom made too And it was real But I wish that simple. Promposal was a thing When I was in high school That I do Promposal is cute I, I love promposal I was around for promposal But I didn't get promposed to <laughs> I love that. The whole love, school, if you know, you know me, you know. I've been dating older men since I was a youngin'. Proposed. <laughs> what happened, so, thing? How we go? My boyfriend at the time, he was too old to go to my prom. Bitch, how old is too old? Don't even say it. <laughs> right, don't. <laughs> don't <even say> it. <laughs> so don't. I went to prom with Frankie. <laughs> <laughs> Frankie is Kim's cousin. <laughs> Shout out to Frankie. Yes. <laughs> Frankie at the prom is yeah. Which I wore match your pink outfits. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bitches got no. I love Frankie. First of all, yes. when I think of Frankie, I just think of Gag City, I, like I, bar. I, He's I, all, the bar. biggest bar. Head okay. Bar, okay. Frankie should have wore the suit that your girlfriend wore. <laughs> Oh, are we oh. going in? Oh, we going in? Are we going Trying in? Trying to have Frankie come out like a big dog <laughs> with sequins. You is funny. <laughs> and it would have been pink. Poop. Okay. All right. Period. She gonna, I'm going I'm to make sure I save all these clips so she can see it when I ask. Come on. Yeah. It's not my girlfriend, okay? <laughs> Kim won't let the, Kim want to be my girlfriend so bad. She's jealous, y'all. No, I went to prom with a gay boy, so I didn't. See, wait, what? <laughs> A gay man family member. <laughs> so that, so nobody asked me to have sex. <laughs> no. And we want prom queen That's queen. one thing I didn't experience. <laughs> I didn't experience the whole prom weekend thing because I was in a relationship. So it's like, you know what? You court, like moms be like, you guys have your whole life to be in a relationship. Just mm -hmm. have fun. Ooh, and tomatoes, blah, blah. tomatoes, tomatoes, tomatoes. I know, for real, I really wish I would have listened because now I'm like, I didn't experience prom weekend. I did a lot of that stuff when I was wait. Like I went to somebody's prom weekend. I was a freshman. Mm -hmm. So see, I didn't have that. I didn't, I didn't experience weekend. my prom because I got kicked out of school. <laughs> <laughs> so I took somebody to their prom, <laughs> and I had the fucking flu ass prom. I felt so bad. I'm so so sorry. I slept the whole prom like Shanice. <laughs> Go back. What you get kicked out for? Fighting? Um, no, I actually went to a really good school. I went to um, economics and high. Economics and finance on Wall Street. Uh, okay. And I was, I came third period every day. Um, I, you know, well, one thing do for it. sure, two things for certain, Shanice's time management is. No, I'm going to make my own schedule no matter where. <laughs> oh, I'm going to make my own schedule. I was like doing my own thing. So that was like a real high, it was like this the number school. one. <laughs> it was like a really like pristine school. Like it was just like one of those highly academic schools. Like they had like a 99% graduation rate. So it was like, oh, you 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 two classes behind because I was think I was taking. Um, they kicked me out the first day of senior year. By the way, I went and got my my um my schedule off the off the desk, and they said, "See you guys, counselor. I ain't having nothing on my schedule." Shanice. So um, Shanice. I was like, because mm, I had to take two two sophomore classes. Like I was like, um, whatever my first and second period class was, I had to take it over for my senior year. They wasn't having that. They don't play that. You you, you got to go. So, yeah, I got kicked out. Well, there's that. Yeah. And yeah. then my second school, I got kicked out, too, because my friends. <laughs> Shanice. <laughs> yeah, it was rough. I got kicked out. You know what? It's the school. past. It is the past. It's the past. Move on, move on. <laughs> She's very smart, y'all. First of all. It be the smart ones. It be the smart all, ones. Me and Shanice have now been doing business together, right? And if you know me, you know my weaknesses may be in some numbers. <laughs> so I'll be telling she certain things. She'd be like, I'm like, what's nine hours from 9 a.m.? She'll just like, boom, know the answer. And I'm over here like. <laughs> 10, 11, 12, 13, no, 1, 2, 10, 11, 12, 1. That's her. And I'll be like, 
She be like, ah, I'm like, wait a goddamn minute. Oh, God, I am still trying to count. She was like, are you sure? I looked at her like, bitch, don't question me. I know I'm right. And I'm like, are meanwhile, sure? like, yeah. when I was in Texas and I was doing it in the class, I went on the phone. Yeah. Hey, Siri, what is... <laughs> But yeah, no, no. I mean, academically, it didn't have, it had it had to do with me always feeling like I gotta create my own. Like I gotta do what I want to. You march to the beat of your own drum. Yeah, I gotta do what I want to do when I want to do it. So yeah. when they when I found out when I got kicked out of my second school that it only took eighteen days to get a GED, I said, "Why well, didn't start with this? Y'all should have led with this. I would have been did this." <laughs> 18 days. I said, "Oh hell yeah, I can do that." Only took eighteen days. It took eighteen days. It's, so that's where we we I, landed. That's where I, that's, that's where, where landed. we landed. Where I landed. You said F all is yeah. Run me my G. I mean, I did go to college for sure. Do sure you feel like feeling like you can beat to the your beat of your own drum has done you more bad than good? Um, it has. It's done me good, but I'm a bad decision maker wholeheartedly. Mm. Like I know for a fact, like it could be like. Pick the yellow, it's $5 million. Pick the green, it's $4,000. I'll be like, green. Just Why? stupid. I just make stupid decisions. And I'll be like, damn, like, yo, you knew you should have picked that I was going to say, that's an informed decision. And you I make choose. really bad decisions. Like, I'm a terrible decision maker. And sometimes it's not even, like, on purpose. It's just like, damn, like, you know, I'm, I think I'm making good decisions, but... I be making bad. I make really bad decisions. I tell you that all the time. I make bad. I make terrible decisions. Terrible decisions. I feel like I'm an impulsive decision maker. So. I'm not impulsive though. I just really make bad decisions. <laughs> Sometimes it just be like my luck too. Know. Sometimes I feel like I just got bad luck too because I could really sit down, think about some shit, and then I think too much of my heart. Good. That's my part, like my issue. Mm. I think I don't know. <laughs> See, I when I was younger though, I definitely felt like I beat to like the beat of my own drum. Mm-hmm. But now, as I'm getting older, I realize how much discipline is a very big factor in life. Mm-hmm. Like, especially trying to run businesses. I'm like, oh, no, you really need to be business or and structured. Like, my mentor would be like, you're too random. Random cannot equal success. Like, you can't be all over the place and think people can follow that. You need to have structure so people can follow. So I'm like, but my whole life, I'll be to my own. My, you gonna tell me to go left? I'm gonna go right just because. Yeah, yeah. That, see, that's not me. I just don't really like instruction. Like, I don't want to. Like, I don't want to be told. You don't tell me what to do. Yeah, authority is my problem. Yeah, I don't. Don't tell me what to I have do. I don't want nobody telling me what to do. So it's just like, yeah. Don't. I gotta be at what time? I gotta do what? I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna get it done, and then leave me alone after that. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. I don't tell me nothing in between. Especially if I know what I like. Like in a post office, if I know what I got to do, the same thing every single day. Why are you coming over here to tell me what to do and I know what to do? I do it every single day. Like, did it get done yesterday? And right. Did it get done the day before? Like, so leave me the fuck alone. Is it off? Is it if I'm, if I'm missing by a minute? Like, no, everything is good. So why are you over here? Leave me yeah. alone. Leave me alone. So it's just like, that's really just it. Yeah. Authority has always been my thing. Yeah, I think that's it for me. Yeah. And I also think that's a talking about generation. This generation, if we think authority is our issue, this new one, they're even worse. What I notice is that a lot of parents don't have time. They yeah. don't have time, and they don't have the. I don't even want to say energy. They don't give a. They don't even care to discipline. It's one of those things where it's just like. They allow the kids to just run amok or have the attitude because they don't want to deal. Mm-hmm. But then that carries over mm-hmm. into situations like this. This carries carries over into public. It carries mm-hmm. over into how they they're raised and they grow up. And now you got these disrespectful kids that you can't tell anything to. That's so true. I watched the so interview entitled. where um, Michelle Obama's my favorite interview, and she was like, "You cannot be your child's friend." No, they're and not. She's like. They, they, don't work. They, you my can't, whole she life, can't my mom used to be like, and I'm not your little friend. And you, she's I'm right. not one of your little friends. Said, um, you can't and be your child's her, friend. friend. Bestie. <laughs> and she said, you can't be your child's friend, and your first, your child's first no can't be from outside. 100% true. Because they're not going to know how to react to it. Mm-hmm. Have to start disciplining them, letting them know what no means, why they can't have certain things, and that the life just don't work the way you think it works. You just mm-hmm. you too busy trying to coddle your children so that they're not mad at you and right. you forgetting to discipline right. them. So now they're going outside acting like that. Right. Shit is scary. 
there was um I was talking to somebody and they were saying how their teacher used to like threaten to like call their mother and they'd be like, Call her. Like if I used to have a fear, do not call my mother. Like I'll do whatever you need me to do for you not to call my mother because I knew if you called my mother and then I oh, had to deal down. with her when I went mm-hmm. home, it was problematic, okay? Now, for a kid to be like, call my mother. Mm-mm. That child doesn't fear you. That child damn sure doesn't respect yeah, I you. I was a call my mother kid. Mm-mm. Was Hell no. I was too. I was a call my mom. Call her. Well, that's because I really, like, I didn't, I wasn't on no board. Yeah, me too. I feel like I ain't do shit. I was really so, like, He really ain't do shit. I you? I don't know. <laughs> we just told us she done got her kicked out of two high schools. Like, <laughs> I really wasn't doing shit. This was in junior high schools. I was definitely a call my mom. So I almost got arrested twice in school for me. Huh? Yeah, and once huh? with my sister. We, yeah. See, uh, see you're not going to speed past. <laughs> yeah, my mom right. got arrested twice. Well, one for me in high school for my sister because, um, oh, God. <laughs> right. Right. So, we need that. So, uh, first of all, first of all, she came into school for something else. I wasn't even in trouble. She walked past the class, and the teacher was yelling at the kids. And he like he was yelling at them for nothing. And she was like, why are you yelling at them kids like that? Mama, mind your business. <laughs> so he went to slam the door on her. She put her foot in the door. Like, oh, 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 they knew my mother. Oh, what? in the door stopped it. You're not going to slip. I'm yelling at these kids like that. What's wrong with y'all? So, Jesus, Lord. But uh, my sister's school, the teacher told her, um, uh, you you always got a new pair of sneakers on. You, you, I hope your grades are something, something like that. It was like, it was some weird shit. She had like the eights. It was like the pink snake eights that had came out. And it was like exclusive. Like nobody had them. And the teacher was like, um, and like embarrassed her in front of the class, like, oh, you got a new pair of sneakers on, but if your grades are something, something about her grades and her, her having sneakers, my sister was a good that's kid. That's out though. of pocket. It was very out of pocket. So and my like, mom, that's not your business. Yeah, but my sister was a good kid. Taquish was a good kid. Me, it's questionable. <laughs> <laughs> it was clear. Yeah. It was clear. <laughs> so, we like, you know, like embarrassing the actual good kid. Like, she felt embarrassed. She felt right. belittled. And my mom's was just like hot behind that now see Hot. now that's different mm-hmm. because as a teacher if you set out to embarrass be little do all step out of line mm-hmm. then that's different gina was coming for you she right. ain't play that <laughs> but if it was me acting a fool and embarrassing her oh i raised you better than this oh oh fire See, I don't have no day. issue with <laughs> shit. I don't have I no love you, issue mom. with like some of the things that the parents do now. I just don't like that it's being recorded. Cause if he acting up in school, you best to believe I'm coming in my bonnet, my house robe, and my you want to embar- and they we from, can, and they we, from here with it. We can embarrass each other. Now you know what? It's no crazy. issue with that. It was a good video. It. it was a really good video. I loved the message of the video. But the only thought I had in my head when I was watching the video, it was a mom. Her son was playing chess. And she was teaching a life lesson about life with chess. Like, mm-hmm. some people may be in front of you, but that doesn't mean they're better than you. Like, it was about chess. Will you save it? No. Because the only thing that went through my head is, I love this conversation. Why are you recording it? Oh. Like, why is everything with your personal home being recorded? Mm-hmm. Like, I'm not going to be like, my son, he's seven, like this. Baby... You see this right here, and you go forward, and then, you know. I mean, you might. No, I'm not. You big on the camera, though. <laughs> not in my personal life all day. You know yeah, when I stopped not. that? <laughs> you know when I stopped that? Honestly, for real, after my last relationship, and I posted our whole entire life, <laughs> I never want to post again. I'll never forget. It Shut was- up. I don't want to hear it. I want to throw up in my mouth. I want to throw up in your mouth. That's why, that's why I can't listen to hours and hours. <laughs> I said, oh, she in love. Wait, first of all, she in love. Hours and hours. I went on some girl's page yesterday, and she posted a video with her best friend mm-hmm. to that song. And I said, this is, why you ain't posting for me? Bye. Here we go. Yeah. Here we go. Some girl made a whole slideshow for you her. You didn't send that to me. Oh, I didn't. No. Oh, I meant to. <laughs> no, it'll be recycled because Kim used that song already. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I said, oh, she in love, love. Ready? <laughs> yeah. Well, I said she got to throw up in her mouth. Ma- ah. And now you yeah. can't even get me to say you're cute. Yeah. No, I'll tell you, though, because I don't really post my baby too much. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't, like, it's social media is for me, not for him. 
And that be, so. but that's the, that goes back to our conversation about social media and people doing things. Like people creating them for social for kids. media. That's weird. And then, and then the captions is acting like it's the baby. <laughs> <laughs> I ate all my vegetables today. Like, Paige, run by my mommy. Baby, six <laughs> months, six months old. So, so. I love this milk. I love this bottle. Like, what are we doing? I ate all my veggies today. I had a great day doing tummy time. Like, that, that's I'm, like people who do that shit for their pets. I don't like it. I love hustle to dance. Hustle to grace. <laughs> hustle, get, hustle not getting paid. Equally hustle. as corny. Huh? I don't like Equally it. as corny. I hate it. Uh, Imagine, uh, follow hustle to great. <laughs> Double underscore. <laughs> hustle to G R A. That's a hood dog right there. <laughs> Little dead back. <laughs> That's it. Just it. Just peed no. on the floor again. This is my mama. Mommy's, <laughs> mommy's gonna get me. <laughs> just ran in the hallway. That's knocked crazy. the little girl over. I'm That's like, Lord. Crazy. Lord. Lord. Oh, yeah, funny. the 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 pages, the page, especially for the kids. <laughs> like <laughs> So I could not imagine giving him a, like I, it never even crossed my mind. Let me make my son a page. Right. No. My mommy's my Valentine. <laughs> it's just us. And then, and, it's, and then it's the pictures. The pictures just look at JC Penny. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm like mm, no. no. Just mm. me and my mommy against the world, girl. <laughs> <laughs> girl. Bestie. Okay. Leave that baby out of it. Right. Yo. <laughs> Yo. Oh my god, that's hilarious! Yeah. I thought I was the only one with that thought. No, I'm like, oh, this I is so wholeheartedly weird. hate it. So goofy. This is so weird. So I don't even. And then the, the page start. The, the baby page just start requesting me. <laughs> <laughs> don't request me from your kids' page because I'll be doing some unsolicited shit on here, right? Yeah. <laughs> you like did little Tina want really want to follow? Well, me? Ashley don't need to see this, okay? <laughs> if she's running that page, like yeah. you making us stink. That's hilarious. No. Y'all. That's funny. If any of y'all got babies with pages, we apologize. I don't. Please. Think about Something it again. Page. <laughs> Just think about it again. Baby. Like, you know. Yeah. And it's, you know, but on a on a more serious note, it's fucking weird. Because you act like there's like pedophiles are out here. Yeah. Yeah. No matter if like the page is private or this, that, and the third, it's just like you are literally delivering your child into no harm the way. Yeah. For it what? For fast, for clout? Too. For clickbait? For What'd what? Like it happens fast too. You ever yeah. seen extremely that? fast? You ever seen that hacker guy? Oh, it's like this guy. He's like dirty at hacking, but he had an interview when he was like proving a point. So he was like, "Yo, like I'm gonna show you how fast like it can happen." He went into like a chat room, and he was pretending to be like a 12 or 13 year old girl, bro. In like two minutes, he had like. 12 messages That is crazy. so scary Crazy Like that As soon as he so made scary. the account People were messaging it Like Crazy 45 year old men shows. Like when Those shows make me so uncomfortable Like Chris Hansen those shows and all that. When they catch them Cause why I are you not catching them more I can't catch watch it them. Like Chris Hansen and shit Yeah yeah, yeah. But why not How to catch a predator Well oh, no you know they doing that now Like, like you, um, regular people right You ever heard of Vitaly no, but I seen a video of so I don't know if that's Vitaly, what it's called. He's like an old. He's a YouTuber. And he streams and shit. Mm. And on his streams, he, he does how one, to right? catch a predator. But they be beating the shit out of them when they yeah, find that's them. Fucked up. It's disgusting. It's and parents. That's the thing. You do these things for clout, attention, whatever it is. The reason, but not realizing like. They're, this world is very scary. Sometimes yeah. people just think, like, my baby is so cute, I want to show them all. So you get some pictures printed out, get your little photo album, and show it to your family. Or go sign them up with Gerba. Put them on a pimp box. Go model, or sure. But <laughs> like, making a a, 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 a a child a page is just No offense, guys. I crazy. Just, it's just not my thing. And it's not only that, but even how he said, like, a hacker, right? Or you, if somebody is good enough, they can literally figure out where this is coming from. Like yeah. the IP address, like nobody even thinks that far. And it's like, how are you not thinking about that? You get me? Like, how right. are you? But see, that's the thing. I feel like a lot of people that make, make pages like that aren't thinking about that. It's crazy. It don't even got to be a hacker. That stuff's real easy. It's yeah. extremely easy. Like, we used to do that. Like we used to go on Omegu. And like, oh my god, I remember that. Like, fuck with people and like yeah. send them their address, like, because it's websites. You did that yeah, just copy and paste. The and hackers hack hack into um 
the ring cameras in them kids' bedrooms. Mm-hmm. That's fucking weird. Like, it's, you have to be careful with stuff like that. Like, some of that stuff is so easy to do. It that, is, like, clearly. That ring shit, once I seen that be a happen, hacker. Like, regular people could get that information. Mm-hmm. Yes. Like, I was in a salon, and I literally read my client's address to her. And she told me, she was like, she was like, oh, I'm not on the internet. Like, I got that cleaned up. And I was like, really? Did a little bop, 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 one, two. And I was like, you live da 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 da, and then this is the name of your husband and your child, and she was like, "Where did you see that?" I was like, "Girl," I said, "It took me literally thirty seconds." Internet's mm. a scary place. Um, you a regular person? I imagine people who like right. really do that shit. What they could find out. Now, don't yeah. let's not be confused. I got a little pi in me, okay? So you need some information. I'm like, there's people that could get into your whole shit, like yes, I can too. yes, go through all your messages, all I can that. Too. Um, I can too. hold on. We cut this, but you're gonna be mad because your bun came out. <gasps> oh, did yes. Oh, it's not that bad though. It's okay. I wanted to cut it so that you could fix it. Because if we would have went on, she needs to like my hair. You see that little peak from last episode? I'm just like, you know, I don't even care no more. All right, we back. <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, it's it's a scary world, and you really got to be conscious. Shanice of can find out who I need her to find in five seconds. I can only imagine what. Oh, I've, Really Child, I like I saw being investigated for something like not nothing troubling, and I said, "Why didn't they think to do such and such and such? Yo, such and such and such." The way her brain thought, I was like, "I was like, why didn't they think like, that?" Like, I said, "I ain't gonna tell them, but they should." You see, even such and such. iPhone now, like oh. when you send a picture to someone, it tells them. Why are you telling? First of all, let's address that Apple. Why are you telling them where I took the picture? Where at? you took it, when, the time. Wow. Like it tells it them is it's a screenshot like of a picture yeah. you took. I know. Thank you, I saw it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Putting it in folders and so, shit. So, I like, know, I saw it. <laughs> so, I said, wow, they're like, trying to get me hemmed up. I mean, like, let me say this so I can see when the picture was really taken. It would get I you I think caught. even on IG, like, they could, they could reverse it and see... Like where I think I don't know if it's where it was the picture is or where it was posted from. Listen, let me tell you something. Like your location when you posted I, it. I, I don't mm-mm. need none of that. Mm-mm. I don't, I need a name and a face. That's all I need. <laughs> and if it's real hefty, it goes in the group chat. We find it in two seconds. Bless you. <laughs> I don't even need. I just need a name, yeah, and a face, and a state. <laughs> I can figure everything else out. Period. The girls really do call me, and they will call me at any time. Two o'clock, three o'clock in the morning. Like y'all, four o'clock, three in the morning is crazy. Yo, if it's if it's urgent, I'm getting up. Be like, who? Hold on, <laughs> hold on, holiday. I'm hold like, on, out here with the headset. Yeah, like, now hold on, what? If it's urgent, I got you. <laughs> looking for. Yeah, but I'm definitely yeah. top investigator. Hit me if you and, and is. And she, is. she was looking for someone. I told her, this is it right here. I'm telling you, this is it right here. I was right, right? I was right. Mm-mm. It was scary. Tap into your investigative skills. I love it. It's so much it's fun. I was it's a little scary, though. I, I, I I used to where my, my, myself from That's looking. the thing, where my mind will go. And I was like, I was talking to Seda. And something happened. I was like, oh, just give me the green light. Just tell me if you want the information. Because I'm going to get it for you. Tell me if you want it. So at first she was like, no. She was like, no, I don't care about why. Gave her a day or two. I said, you ready to release me? <laughs> and she was like, she was like, all right. Like give, me a, give me an hour. I was from here. I said, well, he was living there. And then he moved in. And then he was like, is this his grandmother's name? Because if she was living there. So he might be living there. Yeah. Don't play with me. It's different. Yeah, I don't know how about I used to It's be, different. I used to be really good at investigating. I used to always find out. But now... Like I say all the time, I am drowning. I can't even catch up with my own phone. See, I don't do it that often, so it's kind of fun. Yeah, It's kind of fun when you let me lose. Yeah. I don't investigate nothing in my own personal because I'm totally afraid of what I'm going to find because I'm going to find it. Yeah. So I don't even, like, if I know, if if my intuition is telling me it's something, then I just go with that. I don't even investigate for myself no more because it is, like, I already know. Lately, I've been getting lucky, like, in the last few situations when I... I needed to know something. It literally like landed in my lap. Like it was like a, <laughs> I was like, well, <laughs> remember the Facebook? I'm like people you may know. Facebook is a dirty place. Y'all are dirty people. Yeah, I don't have <laughs> you no know Facebook. I did not know that woman. <laughs> <laughs> 
I did not know that woman, and I should not have known that woman. Okay, yeah, I had none in common. Ah, age gap, ow, crazy. Age gap, nuts. Ooh, I did not know that woman, and now I do. And you gave me everything I needed to know. That's hilarious. Who, uh, talk about people you may not know. People I, I don't should know. not have known. No, stop <laughs> delivering her to me. Mm-mm. Shout out to our serial investigators out there. You have a safe space here. Okay. So we're gonna play a game now. I'm just kidding, but we wanted to play a game today. We got we got a few minutes. Wait, to play I have. A game. The, I really want to add. Right? What? If you, if you were to get welcome back to the streets, what is the, your theme song? <laughs> I'm going last. <laughs> no, you're not. I gotta go last. You gotta go first. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, you do. No, I don't. <laughs> no, I don't. I was like, I got. I gotta play this smart, <laughs> JoJo. <laughs> If you were to get... Like, what vibe would I be on? No. Like, like what your was your song? Welcome Back theme song? You walk into the theme streets... Theme song, like, what vibe... I'm, I what yeah. song yeah. playing? What song playing? To introduce you back to the streets. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> it's both Wayne. Um, every girl... <laughs> <laughs> Wow! Wow! And um, dick pleaser for sure. Oh my god! Go ahead, catalog. I'm on something love shit right now, so I can't even think about some brick guy. I'm looking for the hole stuck in my head. Yo, I can't think past that. I'm looking for the hole. It ain't my fault. That's not my song though. I'm not looking for the holes. I'm looking for the wholesome. I'm on, I'm on some lovey dovey shit. So I'm looking for the whole song. I listen to it complicated by Nivea so much that this boy would be like, oh, daydream about you. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> like, I swear. I swear. Yo. And the kid is like, he is so funny. Like, set up in the dark for so long. <laughs> Yo, he knows the song. He knows the song. He was like, oh, day. So I can't really get no um my ratchet stuff out. And of course, I'm still heavy in. Future, so it will come from a future album. Mm. My daddy. Oh, My real, real quick, daddy. speaking of me, you heard Skilla's new shit? No, I didn't hear Yo, you saw that meme where they were like, whoever raised Skilla, I love you. You did a great job. Right, because he said <laughs> something. Said, oh, he oh, like yeah. older women. Yeah. <laughs> Period. Oh, sure, yeah. <laughs> Period. Let me go listen to How his project. <laughs> He got. He's young. He got to be around. I don't know, but he age, said right? he like older women because they yeah, understand yeah. where he coming from. Yeah, yeah. But he's been making music baby. for a little minute. Wait, he's, a little, he's small to me though. I'm like more of a he Hancho. Is Hancho is more my type. Hancho, Hancho is fine right now. He I got, was he gonna say, got isn't Hancho the one that they was like with Keisha Cole? Yeah, and but and but Hancho is fine as fuck. That's Wait, y'all made me think about. Oh no, there was a twenty, a twenty v me, a twenty v one, whatever, and it was the girl that like went and gave the duet. Did y'all see that? What? What do? I don't know who it was, but it was on, I think it was on like one of the blog sites. And she was like, she she, she oh, said something about hear. a gag reflex. Oh, I did hear. And he was like, show me. And she was like, for real. And then she took him off. And because Cardi B commented on it. That's what it was. What Cardi said? I don't remember. I just needed to see the video. And I was just like, how are we here? Why are we back here? What the fuck? Yeah. Giving head to a stranger is crazy. <laughs> like, it ain't that deep. Clearly, her throat is. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like, when do the morals go all the way out the window? Like, yeah. Ooh, that's crazy. I was like, wait till I tell the girls about this one. I need to see that. Jojo said his theme song is Every Girl. I'm and that was the first one out the gate. <laughs> Wayne, Every it. Girl. I've been on Wayne Heavy as far as only See, you uh, see, I've been on some lovey dovey shit. Complete um 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 Mila J. Like I've really been on some I've been on straight like mixtape. Trying to think. What have I been on? Nothing. <laughs> yeah, I've been on Yeah, I've been on I've been on, I've been on the same rotation of like my stuff. Tori what was I Drake. Today? I don't even remember. You know what song I really do like though? Um, Glorilla and Megan the Stallion. I, I like it a lot. I was like, this glow, glow up. Get glow. That's get my glow. shit. That, that's my song. <laughs> don't say he don't want to be saved. Don't. Yeah. Don't so that might be don't it. That that's my song. I actually Taylor, really like okay? it. I really like that song. So I I'm going to go with that right longer. now. I'm going to go with that one right the now. That's music my shit. though, I'm on straight V's and Skiller. 
I gotta listen to Skilla. It's the only two. But I gotta, listen, Skilla's, I gotta give Skilla some Skilla's some the fans. one with um, Carisha. Girl, you know you fine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if it sounds, if the Skilla's whole the album one, uh, sounds like that, I don't want to hear it. This bitch is icky. Give me Vicky vibes. That'd be in my head all day. <laughs> I never even heard of that. Yeah, it's Vicky. Oh my, <laughs> yo, my God. Yesterday, she was like, you really act like the old head. She, what you said to me? I told her, all right, finish finish, finish this this for me. See you later, alligator. After a while, crack it out. <laughs> 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 no. This bitch said <laughs> I think she said All See right. you tomorrow I'll crack it down <laughs> She said, she said call, me, call you tomorrow Crack it down <laughs> What? Can what? <laughs> Yo, and I was so see confident. You, see saying. you later, alligator. Call you tomorrow, crocodile. <laughs> what? <laughs> it don't even flow. I was so mad. <laughs> I'm so she mad. was like, Kim! <laughs> and he was probably like, what? What? She was, she's like, what? I'm like, that's not, it doesn't go like that. She's like, oh, what she said? So say it again. <laughs> she's, like, she's like, how does it go? Okay, I'm like, so say no, it again. I'm like, no, really, how does it go? And she was like, see you later. Alligator, after, after a while, while crack the dog. She was like, she put the phone up. She's like, okay, so say it again. <laughs> like, Yo. she acts like she's 70. Like, What? You know what? <laughs> it was really Don't sad. You know, see you later, alligator. It was so sad because I was so serious. I know. <laughs> Call you later, crocodile. What? I'll see you tomorrow, crocodile. <laughs> oh my yeah. god! <laughs> Call yeah. you would have been even better because so it was the worst. It was the seas, but I definitely said see you tomorrow, crocodile. <laughs> no, I had a question. Okay. Oh, oh right. my god! Did, did y'all ever play um, Seven Minutes in Heaven? No, down <laughs> by the river. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, hey, definitely was too fresh, yeah. <laughs> you did? No. Uh, yes, you did. I played a lot of things. I played but it, but it wasn't called that. I ain't never played that, but okay. What? You know Down by the River? No, no, what's that? You don't know Down down by the River with the hanky panky, bulldog jump from bank to bank? All right, never mind. They know. If y'all know what they we're know. talking about. If you know what I'm talking about, <clears throat> finish it in the comments. They're probably old like you. I know. <laughs> I was going by the river. Yeah, I was shaking that ass. That's what yeah, I My know, people. <laughs> down at the valley. <laughs> I was going by the river. I was shaking that ass, bending over, pop. See, I was making some cash. Hey. That's the one I know. I don't know any Yo, other. I was like Vine days. Right? Right. I don't even know by the river. You don't know that? River. I was born by the river. I was shaking that ass, bending over, popping pussy. I was making the cash. You see, y'all. Lord, forgive us because we know how it started. I'm so wholesome. I don't even know what that is. Ho. So wholesome. Girl, put somebody else. Yo. I am so wholesome. I don't even know what that is. That's hilarious. You play Seven Minutes in Heaven? No. She the one. She like said it first. Right. That's where I did and Whoever it. asked, whoever, whoever smelt it, dealt it. <laughs> Yo, y'all is childish today. Whoever smelt it, dealt it. No, I really never did that. You went to hooky parties? What's that? Um, When you skip school and go to somebody's house and do like no, do bad we stuff. we have none of that. You ain't skip school? We call them hooky parties in um, New York. I want to say I skipped school because I used to be in the nurse's office sleep. No. Okay. <laughs> I you never went to hooky parties because I nah, felt like I was just too really cool. School, Me Ooh. either. I well, never skipped that. school. Oh. They called our parents too. They got the house number. She My told her her mother oh, almost went to jail. They called straight like the phone number, cell phone. They call, that's that. Remember, we was in school. Yeah, back calling in the, the house. We had house phones. They was back I used to day. skip classes. Oh, no, we skipped. School. They would call my but mother. You know, job. How, you know how you get around it though in high school. They only take the attendance the third period, so we leave fourth. Third period. Third <laughs> yeah. period. Three times a charm. <laughs> I get there third period, leave fourth. That's why I right there for attendance. Yeah. I had this one class skip for like three months. But he knew my mom from the pizzeria. He stole the food. Like he Are you me uh, sure. I was about to say, you had grades time. for the marking period? Like, nah, No, he like literally this. didn't give a fuck about nothing. He was the easiest person in the world. That's some little stupid shit. Yo, oh that God, is I so, failed. Art. That make me feel like a mo- <laughs> like uh like a model stupid. Because I would just be terrible. in school. Like, oh, you can tell out of all three of us, more like. <laughs> more like <laughs> she's like you're talking about more structure, right? Like we over right. here. I dead cannot dead imagine right. Kim in a New York public school. My God, save the people. You what up? Them hooky parties and all that, girl. 
Yeah, yeah. Peer pressure was real. Peer pressure. I told y'all the girl kissed me in front of the school. Peer pressure is real in New York. The one with the suit? The one with the suit. Wow, y'all go all the way back then. So you're trying to say I would have fell for the peer pressure? For sure. We all fall for peer pressure. (laughs) All of us. But I'm just saying New York peer pressure kind of different because all your friends is like, oh, we out fifth period. We out fourth period. Oh, yeah, I didn't need that because I was already bad. It did, so you're going to go. But I would leave, but I'm not going with you. I'm going home. Fuck, I'm going with y'all for. Like, when I used to cut school just to sit across the street from the school, that's stupid to me. I'm going home. Meanwhile, I would have been the one in school charging y'all. Like, you need my homework? (laughs) Hustling. Definitely had the Denise. I, shout out to Denise. Mm-hmm. Got I all my work from her. I definitely used to pay for my work. Oh, yeah, shout out to in Denise. college. I was running it up. Yeah. Need a paper. You did people's work. Hell yeah, Hell making no. that money. It was easy for me, money yeah. especially money if money I took yeah. the class. I couldn't even do my own shit. That's what I'm saying. I used to pay. I pay like I weigh. Like mm-hmm. I say it all the time. In high school, I probably did like four homework assignments. The whole no, high school. I paid. Yeah, I I, no, I got paid to do people's work in college. If you just tell me what it's about, I could, I'll figure it out. Oh, that's my baby father. I don't know how the fuck he made it out. He got he got a um a Regents diploma. Well, he he's a good test taker. In New York, we get Regents diplomas. I don't know if y'all get them here. So you have to pass a test for every subject. You have to get like an 80 or above or something like that, and it gives you a diploma that's like states that like you passed every test. Then you get a regular diploma where you just you pass that with a 65, whatever. But if you pass with a certain, you take all the tests, then you get a Regents diploma. But he didn't. He got through school with everybody doing his work for him. That nigga was in my science class on his break. I mean, on, on my lunch period, he said, when do you go to class? But he was paying them. We would sweat a lot of white and Chinese kids. He used to pay them to do his work. Period. He would just take tests. He used to pass. I was, oh, yeah. uh, see how I make bad decisions? <laughs> he made good decisions. That was a great decision. That's why y'all was yin and yang. Oh, okay. so he was yin and yang, yeah. But maybe if I would have had the same lunch period as him, things would be different. But, yeah, that's how he made it through. That nigga paid for all his work, didn't do his work, and he used to just take the test and pass. He had good memory. So he used to just go through it. Da, 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 okay, whatever. Take the test, he passed. Me, on the other hand, I don't just leave early, come late, don't go here. Then, then fucking Wednesdays we get out at 2 o'clock, and I'm leaving at fucking 1. Like, Shanice, what's wrong with you? Uh, one hour? Right, yes. I did not care for school. No, I didn't. No. I was, better. yeah, I was a good student. You was a good student. I was a terrible student. You was a good student. You probably was a model student. A what? A model student. Like right in the middle. Yeah, like right. Yeah. No. Like, you see how well, um, Gap. Oh, no, I was definitely the opposite. Oh. I used to get in trouble all the time. We used to have uniforms. I used to never even wear my uniform. I loved my uniform. I used to (laughs) always. What the fuck? I did. I loved them. I used you to, like my mom. Yeah, that for real. Crazy. My mom loves school. Loves I taking love taking class. My uniform. mom just loves being in the work. Bro, it's crazy. Like, so roll excited. my little skirt up a little bit. Oh, that says a lot. My mom got two <laughs> kids that hate school. <laughs> <laughs> Them be the ones you got to watch out for. Right. Them Catholic school girls. <laughs> yep, no, I was them. in a committed relationship. Okay. Rolling your skirt up. Whore. It was hot. Well, that damn hot. It was hot. It was hot in the hood. Little whore. (laughs) (laughs) No, them shits was. Our uniforms was cute, but they was ugly because they was like they need to come to your knee. Who is wearing that? You. Uh. Uh. Mm -mm. I love my uniform. You still got it. You still got it. (laughs) She probably do. Mm -hmm. She probably do. Altered it. No. 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 Taylor. Yeah, I definitely used to always get in trouble. My mom used to be like, "I don't understand. You're a senior. You're going to graduate. Why are you still doing this?" I'm like, "She's like, you leave at twelve eighteen. Can't you just get it together for twelve eighteen? Is crazy. And you was wilding for them what four hours you was in school, (laughs) girl. There was one time I was going to leave." Midday, and I got into a fight at seven thirty a.m. Oh my god, Kim. <laughs> Kim. she was worse than me. You see how they talk about me? The bacon, egg, and cheese ain't even digest. I like, told my mom, if it's I, still open. I'm yeah, if I go to school today, I'm going to be home before the period even ends. And she was, <laughs> she thought it was a joke. All right. So when I get busy first thing in the morning, <laughs> you gonna know what's up? And that's what happened. The girl, we had gym together. She walked into my. I was trying to catch her outside, so I didn't fight in the locker room because I wanted everybody to see. She instigated it. Thank and you. the girl came in. She was like, you want to talk? I said, hey, nah, we passed talking. <laughs> see? It was 7.30. And I'm the one in the locker room. I like, was home before She told her she passed talking. <laughs> Gas it. Oh, get the phone. She don't want us all. I was home by 8 a.m. My mom was like, you just got there. I said, I told you this was going to happen. It's, you know. 
and that's there you me. have it i was a better student than kim as you can see and then i was just the best <laughs> it is what it is i mean you can clearly tell you was a better student i still count on my fingers <laughs> <laughs> It's nothing wrong with that point as long as you know how to count. How you get to it as long as you know how to count. But but in your defense, her brain works different, like in a good way. Like she could get like she once she gets it out of here and on to here, is we rolling, we cooking with grease. Okay, it's just the numbers that just get it, get up, eat up every time. Shanice the other day is like, Kim, please do me a favor, write this down for me. So I'm like, she's like, let's do like an umbrella. Write it down, right? She said, so I started doing my umbrella. She That's said, all over the place. This is more like a tornado, but I don't understand what you're saying. <laughs> yes, I'm like, let's do an umbrella to see what's it. Da, 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 da. So she's looking at my, she's like, I don't like it. So she starts writing it down and she's writing it. I'm like, oh, oh. A tornado is oh, crazy. I, if I show you the paper, it literally looks like a tornado. Like, was it the one you posted? The way it comes out. No, but there was one up there too. But um, yeah. It literally, I'm going to show you, I'm going to send it in the group chat. It looks like a tornado, but that's how, I guess that's how it's in her head. But it made sense when she put it on paper. So Girl, this is what I think about at nighttime. First of all, she's going to send that shit in the group chat. I said, this bitch wrote an ebook last night. <laughs> <laughs> no. I said, did she send an ebook? No. It was a she goes, hey, look at, Turn it, it around. Just turn it around. At 9 o'clock this it's morning. It's a brick. It's at night. I came, look, I got here at 9 o'clock this morning, and she's like, did you read it? <laughs> Ah, the clock start now. The clock start now. What is this read, brick? Read what? What is this Bible? Yo, and then I said this to my mentor. I'm like, you're gonna be so proud or whatever. I'm like, I broke it down because they say you can't hire people unless you're able to like give them your model and like be able to teach everything. So if you're not there, whatever. He said, you need to make this a band <laughs> flip. <laughs> I thought it was an ebook. I was like, the fuck. I'm scrolling. I'm still. Scrolling. I'm on my third scroll. I'm like, Kim about to start make a welcome packet. Okay. Oh, 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 yeah, I was over here like, bah, 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 bah. <laughs> she sent a voice note. Next. <laughs> I'm gonna need a voice yeah, note. but then if you talk to me in person, I'll get like f- fog brain. Like I'll instantly not talk. So if I have a time to like sit and think, you get to offload. But not for nothing. That's just how you are. Like she has to get it out and in texting <laughs> or writing it down. That's her thing. Like. I'm an in-person type of person. Like, let's talk in person. Like, figure it oh, out. Oh, yeah, I can't talk in person. I can talk in person all day. <laughs> Her, like, she has to write it out. Mm-hmm. I'm good. I feel like I'm way better at writing versus talking because I feel like I said this all the time. Like, my talking comes off one back too aggressive. And, like, I feel like the point I'm trying to make, I'm not making it. Like, I'm not able to properly say what I'm trying to mm-hmm. say. And it's like, I'm really trying, but <laughs> I'm working Maybe. at it. I, I'm okay. trying to get there. Sometimes I want to text somebody while I'm next to them. Can you please read this? <laughs> please read this. Like, you got because, the message I sent you? That's basically what I mean. <laughs> because, like, I'm really trying. It's just, it's, I'm not good at talking. Like, I'm really not good. And, like, to know me is, like, like, my friends at this point, they already know me. So, they, like, kind of let me just do whatever I need to do. And then, like, when I'm ready, they'll know I'll talk. But... Other than that, like whatever lives in my head, I have to write it down Mm -hmm. because if not, it just doesn't make sense. And I just start talking like I was talking to her and to me, it was so like regular to her. She was like, what the fuck are you talking about? All you're saying is these numbers, letters, and you think it makes sense and it doesn't make sense. Kim, I need to know what you're talking about. And I'm like, okay, all right. I'd be like, slow down. (laughs) Stop. Don't write this down. Hold on. Wait a minute. Go back. So this. okay. And if she's bad, oh my God, Patrona's worse. Patron will be like, okay, go back again. Okay, and explain that. But, but, and, and Patrona's defense, she's a good note taker. She has, she writes everything now. She's everybody a got a, a, a skill. Girl, I told Patrona have seven She's like, questions. hold on, hold on. I'm still writing. <laughs> she has seven questions. I said one sentence. I said, <laughs> <laughs> that's good. But that's what you want. You want but that's good. That's a, she likes yeah. details and she likes to... That's no. not that I say, yo, I ain't gonna lie, good. like, even though you blow mine with your questions, like, you're really gonna go far yeah, because, that. like, you're a good, like, you're a good, it registers in her. Like, I taught her something one time, the 35 questions she asked, the second time she did it, she didn't need me. Yeah. Meanwhile, so I'll be can. like, what? What I said? No, Shanice's problem is, I'll tell her, but Shanice wants to do it her way. No, when you told me it was a straight truck, straight box, I still can't get it right. <laughs> <laughs> she was like... It's a dip box. I'm like, 
She, she, she need, box. I'm like, she needs a straight box truck. <laughs> she's like, oh, straight box. She's like, straight deck. No. <laughs> I said, wait, what is it again? I have to write at the top of the paper in big bold letters. Straight, whatever the fuck. It is. I still don't remember. I just, I, me, I just, I'm, I'm, I'm in 50 different places at once. I'm, I'm, I'm all over the place. So, see, I need. I need colorful pins. I need yeah, highlighters. I, what I said, that's what you got to highlight. I need, I need stuff. I need, I need stuff. Because when I look at it, I need to be it able to. It got to make sense. Yes. For me, Hell though. Yeah. That's why when people write stuff out their way, it has to make sense for me. Or yeah. Like, I have to be able to look at it and understand it from my point of view. Because you could write it out, and it's just going to like words on the page. Like today, I'm telling her something. She's like, no, but Kim, I'm telling you. I'm like, Shanice, what I'm trying to explain is this. She's like, but Kim, you're not. I'm telling you. She don't want to let she want to cut you off so she can finish first. No, you got to listen to what I say first. <laughs> And then you can finish. Oh, this is going to be a beautiful journey. <laughs> this is going to be a beautiful journey, okay? <laughs> Nonstop my- Chronicles <laughs> about to be good. She ain't, well, we she she ain't finna stress me out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is going to be good. She ain't finna she stress Patron out. She ain't finna stress me out. It's hilarious. <laughs> well, where we at? Be perfect. Be done. Be wow. Like, comment, subscribe, and... Let us know if you want to see a vlog. Okay, we are <laughs> Lemon drops next week, guys. And a game. That's wow. with, yeah, yeah. That. What, what is this? What is Hold this? up, y'all. You learned this when you was in Miami with the white people? I was crumping. <laughs> you was crumping. She didn't really vlog, um, um, post her trip. I, <laughs> I was working. Oh, man. Mm. That's good, though. I'm glad you was working. Period. I'm looking like for the girl, I heard that you've been working. Just let me know if it ain't working. Wholesome. Like, comment, subscribe. <laughs>